Experimental Aircraft Association uh, Chapter 1099 is a local organization of about 60 to 65 members, uh, founded about 25 years ago. And they're really uh, focused not only on camaraderie around general aviation, private aviation, and, and building airplanes, uh, but also community outreach. And we're really focused on raising up the next generation of aviators, and we do that through a program that EAA started 25 years ago called Young Eagles. Uh, this program is designed to uh, give free rides to kids between the ages of uh, 8 and 17. Here locally we give about 350 rides a year. Then the second initiative that we're really focused on is the uh, Aviation Center for Education, which is going to be an outdoor community space here at the Stafford Airport. It's a large, uh, long-term project that is really designed to provide a community space. So uh, folks in, in Stafford County can bring their kids out here, play on the playground equipment, enjoy a nice picnic in the pavilion. But what it really is going to do is allow uh, uh, members of the community to come out and, and really experience aviation and have access to general aviation in a way that, that isn't readily available at most airports. We were very fortunate to have one of our uh, EAA chapter members, uh, Gary Lindeen, had an existing relationship with Ray O'Brien and Paul Hanka Honda. Gary suggested that there would be uh, some mutually beneficial partnership through our local chapter and through Pohanka Honda. Pohanka was already uh, very active in supporting uh, other charitable events uh, in the community, so it was a great fit for the 5K event that we were trying to coordinate. So it was great exposure for our title sponsor, uh, and then through uh, their support, not only just monetarily, but also logistically, uh, they really helped, uh, helped our organization uh, offset uh, some of the uh, costs to secure insurance as well as provide some other logistical support as we launched this new uh, uh, charitable event. It's been very important uh, for ownership uh, to, uh, to be active in the community, uh, whether it be the YMCA uh, where we sponsor a race series or whether it be um, um, community events with boys and girls clubs, uh, with the National Opera, um, on the Eastern Shore, they have a pay it forward program where every car that's sold, uh, money is paid into the charity of the consumer's choice. I think if you're going to be not only active in the community, but have a successful business that lasts 100 years, uh, the, 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 the community needs to feel um, that you want to, to have that presence and, and therefore um, continued relationships, uh, valued relationships. Uh, we have the distinct privilege of sending uh, two qualified uh, high school students to uh, an aviation summer camp in Oshkosh, Wisconsin. It's a week-long camp that's all aviation uh, oriented. Uh, not only do they get an opportunity to fly in airplanes and attend one of the largest air shows in the country, but they also spend a lot of time learning about aerodynamics, about aircraft systems, engineering, and they actually get their hands on and learn how to rivet, weld, and do composite layups. So it's been an incredible honor for this organization be able to send uh, almost 10 uh, qualified students up there, all expenses paid. And we really couldn't do that without Pohank and uh, Honda's support. My name is Scott Huff and I'm with EAA Chapter 1099.